So, new in 4.0 beta, USB webcam support. Um, pretty cool feature. Uh, really allows you to do, uh, to, to set up a situation where you can record operators. Um, you can record people coming to use a specific interface. You could set up a in cap, uh, temporary recorders for retail analytics. Um, you can just really do a lot of stuff with this. robotics. You can use the webcams instead of having and using a USB connection to their local device instead of having to use like an IP camera and, and configuring the network switch and everything along with it. So the, it just opens up a lot of new opportunities for using um, NX Witness to manage additional types of kind of video interactions. Um, so how it works is pretty straightforward. Um, as you can see, I'm on my webcam and I'm recording this inside of NX Witness. Um, what it is exactly um, works with USB cameras, works with built-in cameras. Uh, so if you have like a Windows machine or a Ubuntu machine with a, a laptop with a built-in webcam, that will work as well. Um, it even works with like Raspberry Pi camera module. Um, so if you install a server application on a Raspberry Pi and you add the camera module, now you have a smart camera that's capable of uh, recording to itself. Um, how it works specifically is that you have to install the NX server application uh, on a computer um, that is connected to the webcams, webcam or webcams. Um, it can support multiple USB webcams. Uh, also supports dual streaming. Um, and then specifically for the Raspberry Pi, um, you, like I said earlier, you install the server application, you add the camera module, and you can turn your Raspberry Pi into an edge camera. And literally that's all you have to do is install the server application, connect your USB webcam and it will be auto discovered and available to you as a webcam. It shows up just like a normal camera. Um, just like a normal camera you can go in and rename it. So mine is an HD, it's actually a Logitech HD Pro webcam. HD Pro C920. You can get them at Best Buy or Fry's or uh, Amazon depending on how motivated you are to go to the electronic store. Me I like going to the electronics store, so it's a good time. Um, but that's how it works. Um, just like a normal camera, you can go in and you can up, set up the camera settings. You can do motion on it. Uh, you can set up recording on it. Um, when you go into general, you'll see the, the, the vendor. Um, I think the Logitech uh, vendor isn't coming in right now because of beta um, or possibly because the C920 is like a pro version of it. It doesn't really report its vendor because a lot of companies OEM it. Uh, and use it as part of their systems. Um, so possibly that. Um, you notice you don't have an IP address. Um, there is no IP address, obviously. Um, and there are no credentials. Um, basically, if your operating system has access to it, you're going to be able to record it. Um, other than that, it's just your standard old camera. So pretty cool new feature in 4.0. Uh, give it a try. Um, let us know if you have any issues with any uh, USB cameras that you're testing with, it should work pretty universally. So let's see if you guys can break it. Thanks guys.